sure. I know there. Are, I think Corby was one of the harder pulls where it could have Actually, been him you know or another person. I think he was seated D two underneath KD three. Oh yeah, beneath KD three. That's right. My KD three. I heard. Pretty but well he'll likely set. make it to D one on this set. But yeah. who knows? Uh, who, do we, who else do we have? Freon? I think. I think that. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's either him or Freon. Okay. Because um, the the other player in this division who I believe made it out of this match, Andrew. Yeah. So um, I think the winner of this gets out. I think oh, we call him MHJ. Yeah. Okay, sorry. <laughs> no, that's okay. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, Corby takes the first stock. He knows a little bit of the Luigi matchup, but he kind of prefers some other ones. Surprisingly, for Kirby main, he doesn't like the Falcon matchup that much. Oh, so that that is so easy to do with Luigi on Kirby because he's yeah. so so light and fluffy. Yeah. Korean is from which region again? I forget. Oh my. Um, is that an Ottawa shirt that he has on? I think that's a Smash TG shirt. Oh, it is a Smash TG shirt. I just saw the red. Uh, I, I am unaware. So he's from Arizona. He's from Arizona. Oh, I think he's. Thank you oh, for yeah. finding that knowledge for me. Thank you. For us. Yeah. <laughs> I guess he's from like the uh, Havasu um, region Uppie. or something. Oh, Uppy would have killed right there. Yeah. I, I guess he thought the down B would downbeat. also, but it didn't work. Well, you never know what's going through somebody's mind when you're actually playing the game. You know. I'm curious how Horby's thinking about how he's going to play this because he's used to floaties in terms of playing against um, JV Puffs or. Um, right. But I guess Luigi, there aren't that many in our area. Like the only real Luigi players are like the secondaries. Or we just like leave right now, but up we go. Does Revan have to? Does Revan have any? Did you get him? Oh, he's a yeah, get him that. No problem. <laughs> anyway. Even just a general spacing battle right here. Yeah, right? general spacing battle. <laughs> oh, I think he might have wanted to turn around a forward smash, maybe. Yeah, it looked like that. I got caught in his run animation. But he, he got, yeah, he got caught in the run. Full dash. Okay. And at least what, a little bit of what I know from this matchup is that um, Luigi does not want to get stuck near the ledge because well, Kirby's options near there. Yeah. Because down to that, he also is going to. Luigi, okay, away. again, so Shears has this uh, theory that. Nice and I'm sure you, you as chat have seen this on stream a hundred thousand times, so I'm sorry to repeat it. But he says Luigi is unedge guardable. You can't edge guard Luigi; it is impossible. So. You just kill him normally because everything else about him is bad. Yeah, <laughs> that. He's good in doubles though. I mean, again, and I play against Caesar Azar enough that um, I can see he's pretty good in singles. A B kills. Whoa. Okay, so we're we're all tied up right now. And that's the thing, like, um, Corby might outspace him for maybe like two or two to three minutes, but for if he gets at least a couple up airs, um, Corby's gonna die. Like, it might not be a good matchup for Luigi, but if Luigi can get in, who knows what's gonna happen. Because those up combos are gonna kill very early here. That up air was nice. That's some really good insight. You're right about that. That was really good because otherwise, Luigi was going to be right there for him to try to get back. Yeah, and then Corby was probably dead there. Right. We might be seeing a Luigi in top. Whatever. What is it? Twenty-four. Oh, oh, he wanted the up B. Yeah, I think what, Revan's. Would that Corby's, have killed? Yeah, it definitely would have killed. On that plat. Okay. On that platform, it definitely would have. Okay. I think off it would have barely not or something like that. It kills super early versus Kirby. Good to know. Which is why a lot of Luigi mains like this matchup, actually. Oh, that's good for Orby. Very he good. needed something. Perfect. Oh, Leap this is so going. close. He tried to use the win, I think, to uh, cancel there. 
That'll do it. He had to he had to outspace him, so yeah. he had no room to come in. Yeah, that was so that was so smart. Yeah. Because if Luigi comes in and gets back here, but if you stay out, and Luigi doesn't have the recovery there. It was perfectly done right. by Aubrey. That was such a smart. It gave him no options. I'm assuming because of that, then um, Jim and um, uh, Narwhal are playing off stream or something. So now um, up air is weak, which is why, which is why uh, Kirby's not going quite as high. He used it too many times. Now, or it's stale. Yeah. Well, the good thing about now. it being stale though is that you maybe can link more of them into the beat then. Kirby had just a little bit too little damage to do that. Yeah. But that oh, down nice. the down tilt. Wow. The he had no other time. move that would come out that fast. Yeah. So that was that was pretty smart too. Yeah, down smash forward would probably not have worked there. This pool was rather interesting because it had um three people who have been to Nebulous in the past week. It had Horby, it also had Dark Gentleman, and it had um, James from Australia who went to Nebs oh, okay. a little while ago. So, uh, with Luigi. Oh, yeah. Okay. That's such yeah. a good thing to do because it, you have a little bit of invincibility the first few frames you're on the ledge. Yeah. And you run out of them because that move is so long. I've and never so, seen Luigi do that before. Yeah, it's it secures that you get that ledge. Uh, anyway, so. The, oh, the beam. Yep. <laughs> This, this up tilt thing that, that uh, Kirby does, where you up tilt on shield until it breaks shield, you can't yeah. not do that on Luigi. Yeah. Because it just slides really far away. Yep. So it's a lot harder for Kirby to give shield pressure on and actually have those up tilts and shield breaks and all the stuff that he does on other characters. And these have a reason that this matchup is not nearly as bad as you think it would be for being. For many people consider the second best character versus one of the worst. Yeah, exactly. Like, there's those niche matchups where it can be basically okay. So we're one on Horby, right? And then Freenan is up. Yeah. Or Freenan, sorry. I'm assuming he has a good amount of Kirby experience also because I think from that reach, I think Daniels is a Kirby main. I'm not sure, though. Daniel? No, da Daniels. 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 Is right. that a Kirby or Falcon? Oh, he dropped down. And then got forward here. Oh, that is not good. Oh, that, that's sad to see. I feel yeah. bad. It's bad if a character who usually will recover SDs like that because... He just one drops and it gets hit. <laughs> yeah. Whoops, I dropped. That fireball clank for the up tilt allowed him to grab him right afterwards. Yeah, that's what happens. Um, a lot of the time, a fireball will clank with an up tilt. Down tilt. And he's... No. Oh! Yeah, he's, he's so dead. <laughs> okay, Horby down this time. Yeah. Horby needs to really pull this up. That will help a lot. Uh -oh. I assume Horby was... Horby's the overdog right now, right? Freehand would be the underdog. You know? Yeah. Well, Horby got, I think, ninth or something at the uh, Keystone, so... You see it pretty high in this. Like, I think they'll lose against KD3, but then definitely make it into um, next round of pulls. Not sure what happened to Free in this pool. Like if he came from like round three or if he got second in this pool or I know some people advanced like further than they technically should have in terms of div three, div two because um few people were missing. Oh yeah, absolutely. Like Jimmy Joe and um well, SKG. SKG especially. Yeah, SKG apparition. <laughs> yeah. SKG his pool someone just fell asleep and didn't come. Yeah. So That platform, I think, messed up the B chance there, right? Yeah, a little bit. Uh, he, he landed, so. Up smash. <laughs> Just YOLO up smash. He's like, yeah. I'm going to read this. I'm was... done with this stock. Can we can we stop dancing around? Yeah. And that was a good nair because it covered the um, uh, rolls. He's doing well. the same thing that he air? did before, making Luigi stay far away. Yeah. He's if he comes in, he gets hit. Exactly. 
He's like he's learning how to play the matchup as he's going along. <laughs> you might be right about that. He's doing a good job of it, though. Yeah. He's, he's, he won the last set, and he's almost pulling this one back from a loss. For the couple people in chat who don't know Horby, by the way, um, he's a pretty new school player from um, New York City. He started coming. He was an okay player. He didn't switch the game control and became really good really quickly. And he's probably the best in the this scene. Along with um, Fyro. <laughs> Oh, Jimmy yeah, fire. <laughs> Get away! Get away! Horby! Okay. It's <laughs> up to Horby there. <laughs> We're saying that's right. It's that up to Horby. He's, like, he's trying to avoid getting hit by that 